guys. Even the all this evening, I'm going to show you guys again. I church, I church. This is situated in Churchill, Christ Church, but I bet it's just above Oystings. And it's right next door to Foundation School, which is one of the oldest and top secondary schools in Barbados. This is Christ Church, Parish Church here. And this is the church hall next door, which is over here with the center. Church Parish Church in the southern parish of Christ Church in Barbados. Unfortunately, again, the church is not open, but here is a frame giving a brief history of the church. This church was rebuilt, was built and rebuilt several times. I know for sure the first location was in Dover Christ Church, which is in also in the on the south coast of Barbados, in close proximity to St. Lawrence Gap, but that was destroyed by a hurricane. And it was built and rebuilt several times. But it last it was destroyed by fire in 1935 and it was rebuilt. But it wasn't fully damaged, but it was partially damaged. This is, album. this is the album showing the old fort of the church. And another frame, sorry, showing the old fort of the church. This is a fort of the church, parish church, in its earlier times. And here's another frame giving another history of the church. And a frame showing the past and present priests of Christ church, parish church. And here's a plaque. The plaque says a commemorative plaque on the occasion of the 365th anniversary of Christ Church Parish Church, unveiled on May 18, 1995, by Canon Malcolm Aubrey Maxwell, uh, which is named after the MA stands for, who was the rector of this church from 1976 to 1984, and now it's Deacon of Barbados from 1984 to 1990. <coughs> yes, guys. This church is famous for the Chase Vault. This is in the church cemetery, the churchyard. It's set up coffins, tend to move about within the church, in the, within the vault. Some say it is a myth and some say it is a true story. But a lot of historians and theologians say that it is a true story, but some people say it is not a true story. So I have no proof. But they say that coffins tend to move about within the, the vault. Churchyard, you will find the tomb, the grave of one of Barbados's prime ministers who served briefly after he succeeded Tom Adams. His name is Sahara St. John, or Sahara Bernard St. John, are known to many older Barbadians who were living his time as Bree St. John. And this is his grave here, his grave here. Who served, he served Christ Church, he, he served as prime minister for one term after he succeeded Tom Adams. Tom Adams died in office in 1985 and he succeeded Tom Adams from 1985 to 1986 until Arabara won the victory again in 1986 and when he too died in office in 1987 on the 1st of June. And this is Christ Church, Parish Church again. Each time we come here the church is not opened. I hope to give you guys a tour of the church when it's open. Even though I have a few f f f videos of this church, but they're not talking videos as such, but I have videos of inside the church. I'll have to post it. I'll show you guys what inside looks like. Now I look at the chase vault before I go to the other end of the church.
It's like, like some bell or something, but this is not the bell. The bell is situated in the bell free, in the bell tower up here. This is the porch. Of the porch, of the church. And this is the door to enter the stairs, the balcony. Cemetery here, you will find Christ Church Cemetery, which is a separate from the church, separate from the church cemetery. The Christ Church Cemetery behind here, where the wall is, is owned by the government. That's a government cemetery, but it's all if it's within close proximity to each other. And this is Christ Church at the end of Christ Church Parish Church. Parish Church. I have a few videos I took of Christ Church, Parish Church, some time back, some times back, with inside of the church. Okay, this is Christ Church, Parish Church. You can see the tower has a crack in it. And now we're now going to show you guys the church hall. This is the church hall. Center where we keep Sunday school. Where the door open is. Where the door is open. This is where we keep Sunday school classes. So the extension of the church center was dedicated. The completion and extension of the church center was dedicated and commissioned by His Grace, the, Rev the Most Reverend Dr. John W. D. Holder, which stands for John Walter Dunlop Holder, who was the Archbishop of the West Indies and the Bishop of Barbados on Sunday, October 7, 2012, and was officially opened by Canon Austin Carrington, who is the rector of Christ Church Parish Church on a site that has served the church and community through religion, education, recreation and social action. Plot unveiled by Mr. Christian Bess and Mr. L. Ronald Bradshaw to go with the glory. This is the church centre here, known as the Ivan Hero Centre. This is the church here again. The front view of the facade of the church. This is the church centre and this is the church office. All this is the church center, of course, Church Parish Church. And it keeps functions here. We keep a lot of functions in here. I haven't seen any functions kept here lately, but we keep a lot of functions here. All here is the church center, but I know that I even here was center. And we did the diocesan, the diocesan secretariat office. The diocesan secretariat office is also in the church center. And here is another tablet plaque saying that the church center was dedicated and commissioned by Reverend John W. D. Holder again, who is the Bishop of Barbados on the 9th of December 2000, by the Reverend Canon Ivan Hill, who was director of Christ Church Parish Church from 1984 to 2001, on a site which has served the nation through education, recreation, and social action. The Boys Foundation School, 1809 to 1957. Christ Church High School 1957 to 1992, Jones Private School from 1993 to 1996, and the plot was unveiled by Mr. Alwyn Howell and Miss Regina Bess. Yes, well, this is the church centre here. And right in the middle of the church is Christ Church Foundation School, which is one of the top and oldest secondary schools in Barbados. Christ Church Foundation Secondary School. This is the school here. This is the church right next to the Christ Church Parish Church. 
and this is the church hall and the church in the background so Christ Church Parish Church the church centre and the Irving Johnson Hall this is the body touch right in the centre and the Christ Church Foundation School all in Church Hill, Christ Church Barbados just above the tongue of oysters Thanks for watching and have a blessed evening.